I don't know. Uh, I'm glad you're taking more C, and I'm especially glad you're feeling wonderful. That's terrific. To me, you're doing something right. I think you would agree. Along with this, you have a skin symptom. Now, maybe that skin symptom has something to do with vitamin C, or maybe it has nothing to do with it. Maybe it's something else you ate. Maybe it's who knows what. You're mentioning it could be a detoxification uh, symptom. It might be. After all, the body does go through detoxes, and the skin is your largest organ, and it is an organ of excretion. We keep forgetting that, but when you sweat, you are actually losing stuff through your skin. You're losing waste through your skin. Uh, you have only to go into a locker room that hasn't been cleaned to smell and believe. <laughs> uh, you may find if you have more vegetable juices, which are known to help detox the body like nothing else, that this problem will go away. So that's what I would try. I would go into vegetable juicing big time, make sure you're on a plant-based diet, make sure you're avoiding things that are known to provoke acne, like a lot of fat in the diet. Uh, chocolate is famously supposed to officially not cause acne, but I think off the record an awful lot of people disagree with that. A lot of chocolate is a really good way to have acne. Maybe the acne is due to some other factor. I don't know, allergy, clothing, who knows. But the first thing to do is to work on your guess because it's so straightforward to do. If you think it's a detox, if you take more C, you'll detox better. Vitamin C is an antitoxin. Dr. Thomas Levy talks about that a lot, and he's right. And if you have more vegetable juices, you're going to detox your body like there's no tomorrow, and Dr. Max Gerson uh, talked a lot about that. So my first suggestion would be, why not test your theory, go nuts, and really load up in the vegetable juices, something which is very safe. I don't think you can hurt yourself with vegetables, and putting them through a juicer does not make them any more dangerous than they were when you were just eating them. So have lots.